After spending an entire week honing on what in my opinion is one of the most underrated reserves on the entire game, today I'ma show you my best skills of the last 7 days honing on Medved Taiga. So far we have done this challenge on 9 of the 15 maps that are currently available on the game, so if you enjoyed this series, please make sure to subscribe to the channel to receive the notifications for all the upcoming episodes. And before we start, let me know in the comments, what is your favorite animal of all the species present on Medved Taiga? And also, from all the trophies you have gotten on this reserve, which one is your favorite? I would love to know. Look at what I just spotted. A level 3 monster with an estimate of 227 to 281. No way. That's the first level 3 monster I've seen in like 2 years. And the only two weapons I'm carrying that are appropriate for class 2 species are both the 45 Colt and the Recurve. I've no intention to use the Recurve this time, so I'ma use the 45 Colt. He's a Tenif. Less than 100 meters out. He's walking. As soon as he stops, I'ma shoot him. Okay. Can we get a hard shot? And he's down. Not sure if it was a hard shot, but what matters is that he's down. Look at those toasts. Will this be the first diamond of the week? Let's cross our fingers. 254.43, let's go. A diamond monster, the first diamond of the week. And we hit the heart. Nice double long and hard shot at 91 meters. What a trophy. These guys are in common. I would say the monster is my favorite species from Medved Taiga, so I honestly couldn't be more happy about this diamond. Level 3. Level 3 Cover Kaylee, that is the second max level we see this week. He's getting far. Well, he's landing. What is he gonna do? Is he gonna fly this way? Please fly this way. Oh, I think he is. No, never mind, he's heading north. Man, I heard the warning call when he was like 50 meters away and I couldn't spot it. We could have easily dropped him if I saw him on time, but now we're gonna have to chase him. I hear him. Oh! There he is! We are gonna use the 12 gauge cachatore. And we hit him. He's going down. So here we have it. The second max level of the week. A level 3 Copper Kaylee. Very high chance there is a diamond. You know, so far I've gotten like easily 20 level 3 Copper Kayleys, and only one of them has been a troll. Let's see a score of this one. 4.75. Here is a diamond. The second diamond of the week. It is only Copper Kaylee, but I will take it. I mean, no one can deny the Copper Kayleys are a very common diamond. Maybe the most common diamond on the entire game, but they look amazing. Max Smith Lynx. A potential level 9 Lynx. He has a feed zone right here. I wonder if we spoke them. Okay, this tracks is run, so we actually spoke them. No reason to be sneaky now. We are simply gonna run behind it and eventually we're gonna reach him. He should be just ahead. Yeah, there he is. Oh! 27 to 30 estimate, it is a level 9. A level 9 links on Medve Taiga, only a few days after finding one on Revontuli Coast. And we could actually drop him here. With a 44. Come on. Not the best angle. Let's try here. Oh, come on, now we can see him. Where is he? There's so much vegetation here that is no surprise. Actually, there's this frozen river very close to us, so maybe he's headed there. Yeah, he's gonna be right on the open. Right there. You aren't gonna escape this time, buddy. Look at how close they are. Right on the open. Let's see. Alright, he turned to the right slightly. We need a better angle. Let's just keep running. You'd be ridiculous if he manages to escape once again. We gotta shoot him here. 
Ok, that's good. Let's go for it, Obolong. No! He's down. What am I doing? I almost messed it up. The first shot was horrible. I don't know why it happened, but my aim was absolutely terrible on that first shot. Luckily, we got a barrel on the second. No way. We saved it. It's actually been a very long time since the last time I messed up a diamond, but it's gonna happen again at some point. You never know. Luckily, it wasn't this time. It would have sucked to mess up such a rare trophy. We still don't know if it is a diamond, though. Hopefully it is. 27.76. He's a diamond. The third diamond of the week. A diamond links. Look at the first shot. Such a bad shot. And we can say it was a risky shot because that is exactly the kind of shot I take all the time. We got very lucky, eh? I could be mistaken, but I think that is a melanistic. A melanistic female mosdeer. The first rare of the week. Look at the difference. I'm still not 100% sure, but here we can see it is clearly darker than a common. And that one has the darker common variation, so it is clearly mela. I think I've only gotten one melanistic of this guys, and it was a male. I don't think I've ever gotten a female. Well, maybe back when I used to play on Xbox, but definitely not here on PC. So it's honestly great to see. You know, I don't think the females are as rare as the males because the population of females is probably much bigger than the population of males. I mean, the females seem to be way more common, but it's also a very, very rare rare. So let's shoot her here. With a 45 cold. She's completely her own, so I'ma try to hit her hard. She's down. Here we have it. It is not as dark as other melanistics. It actually reminds me a lot to the melanistic road deer. I believe it is the same pattern. So yeah, that is the first rare of the week. What a trophy. And surprisingly, we didn't hit the heart. We hit the right lung, the liver and the stomach. Still a good shot. No way! We are in the world, we are being attacked by a level 9 wolf. A level 9 grey wolf. What are the odds? Right here. 37 to 39 estimate, not the most promising estimate. Maybe troll, I've been trolled several times by level 9 wolves, so I wouldn't get my hopes up too much. And man, being so close, we gotta try to get him using the recurve. Easy there, buddy. Just stay still. We gotta be really careful, eh? We really don't wanna mess this guy up. Okay, stay there. That's it. We hit a barrel. Yes. Who would have thought? We were found by a potential diamond. Hopefully diamond. Actually, I think it would be my first diamond grey wolf here on Medved Taiga. So it is definitely a very special trophy. Let's see a score. 39.37. He made it. He made it. 4 hour 4. Every single max level we have found this week has been a diamond. And this one is very special because, as I said, it is my first ever diamond grey wolf here on Medved. The fourth diamond of the week. Oh! Hey! That's something. How didn't I see it when he was drinking? I mean, I just got to check this pond. And I spotted a couple more brown bears, but somehow I didn't see this guy. So I guess he was drinking there where I couldn't see it. You know, the other two are there right on the open, but this guy should have been way closer. Now I wonder how far he'll go before he stops to drink again. He should continue drinking at some point. Hopefully before he reaches the forest. I think we should try to stop him. 
Oh, he's drinking. He's drinking, so now we can approach him. Now we can sneak up to it and try to get him using the recurve. Thirty-six meters out, he's still on the same position, and he's facing that way, so he can see us. I'm a crawl to the right. I think our goal here should be to take cover on that tree. And now we have full cover. All right. How far are we? We should be like twenty-five meters away. Yeah. Exactly 25 meters away. So we are on a very, very good position to shoot him. Let's see. We are gonna use the recurve. Right there. And we hit a barrel. This is the fifth max level we have found this week. The four we got previously were all diamonds, so hopefully that train continues and this is also a diamond. Let's see a score. 27.79, he's a diamond. Look at that. 448 kilos, it is barely diamond. We hit a single long. It is honestly surprising to see these 540 grain arrows don't have enough penetration to reach both longs at 25 meters. And not even close. Well, that's something. A Bible female Siberian moss deer. And not only that, I also spotted a huge max estimate moss deer over there. Not that one though. That one. Up to 270 estimate. He's only level 2, but the level 2 moss deers are able to make it, so he's a potential diamond. We are gonna start by showing the Bible, since it is actually a guaranteed trophy. And then we'll go for the max estimate. Let's see. She's at Enif. Facing us. And that's it. Oh, did we spook the Max Estimate? No, that is the other Max Estimate. The big one is still there. He's alert, but he's still there. I'ma harvest this Bible real quick. Nice rare. And something funny is that the pattern on this one is actually the exact same pattern the Bible road deers have. Hell, actually, even the body of the most deers on this game seems to be a straight modification of the body of the road deers. They look very, very similar. Now we're gonna shoot the Max Estimate. I don't think he'll make it, but there's a chance. We are less than 100 meters out, he's at Enif. Now come. Man, I can't believe he hasn't noticed us. Somehow he hasn't seen us. He's at Enif again. How close are we gonna manage to get before he realizes what's happening? Less than 40 meters out, no way. We are gonna shoot him here, with the 45 cold. And he's so close that I feel like using iron sights. Now, the actual reason why he hasn't seen us is because the current snowstorm is giving us cover. Now, let's see a score. Is this a level 2 diamond? The estimate was quite promising, so maybe. Oh, no way! He actually made it! He's actually diamond, a level 2 diamond monster, 249.09. That's crazy. I was not expecting it to make it. I mean, while making this video, I've killed another 4 or 5 monsters with a very similar estimate, and none of them made it. So, this is a huge surprise. And the fact we just got a rare any diamond of the same lake, of the same session, is just crazy. This lake is insane for monsters.